wearing the NC State jersey. Man. Uh, it means it means everything. I just got here last year, but it feels like I've been here forever already. So uh, I've been embracing the culture, and Coach Doran has definitely engraved it in my mind. Is it still a newness to it, or is it now your normal? No. Nah, I got it now. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, I understand. I don't know if you're aware of what Peyton Wilson was and represented and meant to this team mm -hmm. so much over his career, but how do you look at that as a challenge and you know a responsibility to kind of find that new focal point of the defense that hey we need a now NC State known for linebackers being stellar yeah. now it's our turn yeah I mean you know linebacker with coach Gibson coming linebackers always been like notoriously good here but I feel like DBs really have to step up you know it's kind of been. It's kind of been like a shaky room for us. A lot of injuries throughout these past years, and linebacker production has been crazy. But I know now we're probably the deepest group, uh, honestly, on the whole defense. So I think we really could step up and be the best unit on this defense. What's the motivation of the number change, if you haven't already been asked? Um, it was just, you know, we got a lot of new guys, and they all didn't want, like, any bad numbers. So I said I just switched yeah, to seven. It was open, so I just took it. You've got a victory day coming up tomorrow evening. What does that event mean to you guys? Um, it's huge. Just honestly, Coach Doran makes it such an important thing. Like, honestly, as big as a game here at NC State. Um, you know, just giving back to the community. And Coach Doran has um, – he has kids and family that's challenged, so just coming out for Victory Day is huge for us. You mentioned your teammates. What would you like to have Perry and DK and Jihad just show up? And mm -hmm. Okay, these are my guys now. Yeah, we've been working all summer. Jihad, Jihad's from Virginia, so me and him kind of already knew each other. But um, just working out with each other all summer, just pushing each other to be better and raising the standard in the DB room. What's been the motto so far, or the new slogan introduced throughout training camp that you guys have to revolve around? Um, kind of, kind of just, uh, you know, they're kind of sleeping on our defense right now, I feel like. I know our offense is getting a lot of uh, attention right now because all the transfers and Grayson and Noah and Casey and all them, but kind of just upholding the standard. That's what Gibson, Coach Gibby's been on, so that's what we've been on, you know, just flying around and continue to produce like we've been producing. How much more comfortable are you? I mean, you think back to this time last year, mm -hmm. just arriving. Yeah, I'm way more comfortable. Um, I've been out here, you know, for about a full year now, so I finally know everything. I know both spots. I'm able to coach it. I'm able to do it, and I'm able to play fast. And I think that's the biggest thing for me this year. Against always had an elite defense. I mean, is this another one? Do you feel? Yeah, yeah. I feel like this defense. Honestly, you know, they said that about last year's defense with all the linebackers leaving. They thought we were going to drop, and we probably had maybe even a better year. So I think this year, you know, that's what we're trying to do every year. Just do one step better. Coach but, says, is it, coach says it's the culture. I mean, can you explain that to me a little bit? Yeah, Coach Gibby's done an amazing job of just, yeah, just like demanding the culture upon us, and he engraves in our brain every day, every meeting. If y'all heard the meetings, man, it was. Man, y'all don't want to hear the meeting. It's a pretty, it's a pretty crazy meeting, but. But, it's, but it's some of the jokes that the safeties have with Sean Brown now. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, we kind of just joke on him going to linebacker, you know, putting on weight, um, you know, kind of saying he can't cover now, stuff like that. But Sean, Sean can play everything, and he's like a Swiss Army knife in this defense. And, you know, he could honestly play safety if he really needed to. So I, I salute to Sean for being able to make that switch and just being able to embrace that role. Have you played yourself in college football video? Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. Are you a gamer? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty – I game a lot. Who, who 